What is up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Easy Tech News and today we have seen a very very interesting news. Also there's got a lot of me pictures that's coming up right now. now. I'm gonna do a really you know explanation of what's going on. So Easy Tech posted a uh, very long statement which I'm gonna really read and I'm gonna end up with all of these uh, things in the very end. Also uh, a Easy Tech staff in uh, EFC community also posted his name is James Yang he also posted in the forum so I'm gonna read from the forum and we give you guys some image so the new game is coming soon Rome a mysterious country around the Mediterranean this elegant city is full of secrets historical secrets and let us explore together so now we have the first image of the uh, Capitoline uh, Wolf the uh, Capitoline Wolf Italian Lupa Catilone Cap Capitolina, Capitolina, sorry. It's a bronze sculpture depicting a scene from the legend of the founding of Rome. The sculpture shows a she wolf sucking the mythical twin founders of Rome, Romulus and Remus. According to the legend, when Nomito, grandfather of the twins, was overthrown by his brother Omilius, the usurper ordered them to be casted into the Tiber River. They were rescued by a she wolf who cared for them until a herdsman. Faustulus found and raised them. The age and origin of the Capitoline Wolf is controversial. The statue was long thought to be an Asturian work in the 5th century BC, with the twin added in the late 15th century AD. Probably the sculptor Antonio Polalio. However, uh, Radio Carbon and Thermo was that Thermo Melongenesins dating has found that the wolf portion of the statue is likely to have been casted between. 1021 and 1153. The image of the she wolf sucking uh, Romulus and Remus is a symbol of Rome since the ancient time and one of the most recognizable icons of ancient mythology. The sculpture has been housed since 1471 in the Palacio de uh, Conservatori on the Cappadocia, the ancient uh, capital line hill, Rome, Italy, and there are many replicas in various places around the world. Ancient Rome went through three stages. There are Roman Kingdom, the Roman Republic, and the Roman Empire. As the fourth, as one of the four ancient civilizations, there are also many well-known figures in ancient history. So we have the first uh, triumvirate. We have uh, M. L. Crassus, uh, Julius Caesar, and Pompeius. The first triumvirate, uh, trium or trium? This is triumvirate. A triumvirate or triumvirate? Uh, I don't know. I don't speak Italian, but. Hopefully I didn't I didn't butcher that name. Okay, the first team Virate was an informal political alliance of three prominent men between 60 and 53 BC during the late Roman Republic. Gauss Julius Caesar, Gennes Pompeius Magnus Pompey the Great, and Marcus Linus Crassus. And we have the second team Virate, which is Anthony Octavian and Lepidus, formed in 43 BCE. This term this. Triumvirate also succumbed to jealousy and ambition. The second Triumvirate is name is the name historian has to given to the official political alliance of Gaius Julius Caesar, Octavius Venus, Caesar Augustus, uh, Marcus Antonius, Mark Anthony, and Marcus Emilius Lepidus, formed in the 27 November 43 BC with the enactment of the Lex uh, Titia. The adoption of which some of you as the marking end of the Roman Republic, whilst on the Arger Arger the Battle of the Actium or the Octavian becoming Caesar's Augustus in 27 BC. The Triumvirate exists for two for two five year terms, covering the period 43 BC through 33 BC. Unlike the early first Triumvirate, the second Triumvirate was an official, legally established institution whose overwhelming power in the Roman state was given full legal sanction and whose imperium ma imperium mess outrank that all of the magistrates including cons uh, the consults and we have the final image of i don't know who's this guy but some of us, if you compare the face i think it looks like anthony mark anthony last but not least easy take notes that you guys will be very curious about the man in the last picture however we will not tell you who it is at once he is one of the best general in the new game you guys could try to guess who he is and very well we have the final image uh i mean it looks really detailed i love it i love the way he looks so detailed uh so i'm gonna run it down right now so first of all who is this guy uh, I cannot tell who he is. I'm, I'm not really sure what the portrait of Easy Tech is gonna be. But if you compare it to the second Trimirante, I think he looks like Anthony with the hair. 
and he, he might also look like Octavian if you look at the hair but if you look at the facial expression also at the eye also at the chin and also at the uh, the, the ear I think it's gonna be Anthony and if compared to Octavian it doesn't really look like him and if you have a look at Caesar it's way it's not him but it might be him but it depends I don't know I don't know which one okay so Another thing I'm gonna run down is that the image quality. Yes, EasyTech really did a good job this time. The image quality looks legit. It looks so nice. It looks so HD, and we have a really, really, you know, uh, uh, really gray background. However, the image does have some, you know, lights on it. It looks so great. Uh, I never thought that EasyTech could reach at this moment. And if you compare. Uh, every uh, last portrait of easy tech generals and game uh, to this one I think this one has the best one and also I think we're gonna have the uh, trailer really soon because the last time we got the image like this after they tease it we got the trailer within a month uh, I'm not so sure when but they say that their game will coming around uh, April or May or late in May, it depends on their time. But I can say that right now everything is 80% done since they have the first image. And I think I think this guy who I uh, think that is going to be uh, Anthony, Mark Anthony, I think Anthony might be in the game, you know, general, premium generals, since there are statements saying that he is one of the best generals in the new games by James Yang from AC Tech staff. So definitely he's gonna be a premium general. So is it gonna have another premium general? It can either be, you know, Julius Caesar, uh, Mac Anthony, Octavian, Pompey. Uh, definitely it's gonna be set in Rome, ancient time. Uh, I don't know about the game's mechanics. Uh, I don't know whether they adopted uh, the World Congress 4 game mechanics or they adopted the European World 6 mechanic or they developed their new um, um, mechanics of the game. I still don't know about that. But to have an image of this really HD, I believe that it's going to be great. It's going gonna, it's gonna to affect a lot. And we are, uh, as a player and also fan of Easy Tech games, we would believe that Easy Tech would not let us down with all the map. So we're gonna have the Roman Empire, we're gonna have the First Republic, we're gonna have the uh, uh, Rise of Rome, uh, sorry, Roman Kingdom, uh, uh, Rome Republic and Roman Empire, and then we're gonna have Eastern Roman Empire, and then we're gonna have Western Roman Empire, and then we're gonna have the Battle of the Turbuk Forest, uh, which uh, Arminius, you know, betrayed Rome. Uh, he he formed I think he 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 uh, attacked from the forest at the Torbuk Forest. If you guys uh, remember, and if you guys play Rome Total War and Rome Two Total War, you guys might know what I'm saying. So definitely, this is one of the greatest image Easy Tech ever shared from their staff. It looks so nice, and this new has been posted for a while. I think it's six or seven hours already. But I'm just home. I'm just home. You know, back from work and stuff, so that I can do some video with all you guys, showing also explaining on what's going on. So definitely, uh, we are hoping that Easy Tech would release more image so that we can uh, have a look on what's going on and what's next in the next uh, teaser. So I hope you guys enjoy this and share some thought. What do you guys think? Uh, what's going to be in the game? Uh, you know, anything you guys want to say to Easy Tech. So put it down in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys next time. If you guys want to have a look at it by yourself, definitely check out the link in the description. I will link it to the official forum, also to official website, and also to official Facebook page of Easy Tech. Hope you guys enjoy this. See you guys next time. Have a nice day.